Hi, my name is Konstantin Magnus. In this Houdini tutorial, we are going to draw a silhouette around a 3D mesh. As per usual, you can download some example files on this on my Procygen website. The link is in the description. Now, inside Houdini, we are going to create a pick hat as an example mesh. And just to clarify, we want to draw a silhouette not as a slice uh, that cuts through the pick hat, but we actually want to draw the outline as seen by the camera's perspective. So let's create a camera and copy the node of the camera and dive inside the geometry network. Now, first of all, we want to apply the normal device coordinates of the camera to our mesh. So we will first of all set a string to the camera operator hit on this icon and just paste to get the path of the camera. I put OP column in front. And now there's a function which we use to assign the normal device coordinates. It's called 2NDC. And we would just refer to our camera and we will feed in the point positions. Now, when you click spacebar H, you will see that the head has been transformed. And we would next flatten the Z coordinate to zero. Press spacebar H again to see it. And what you will also find is when we dive inside the camera again and see the original head, maybe click on the icon to move the camera with us you'll see that now the, um, the mesh in the background is being updated. There's one more thing we need to adjust though. It's uh, the aspect ratio. So we would divide the Y component by 16 divided by nine, which is the aspect ratio of the camera. Now, the next steps would be to uh, just extract the silhouette and there is a um, triangulate 2D node we could use. If you put in an asterisk sign in the silhouette and say flood from convex hull, you will get uh, just the flattened mesh itself without the connections on the boundary. And then there's the divide node, which can be used to just remove the shared edges. So that would be our outline. Optionally, you can also resample that by using a finer resolution and subdivide the curve. Now, if you only want the outline, you can also use the ends node to unroll it with shared points. And that would be just the curve matching the 3D view. Now for testing, you can just dive inside the camera, lock it and move a bit and then you should see it being updated. Thank you for watching.